Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome to Unavowed. Now this is a game that I've been dying to play for a very, very long time and just have never got around to for various different reasons, but we're finally going to play it blind on the channel now. I've heard unbelievable things about this. It looks incredible from the screenshots that I've seen. So we're heading into it. I'm going to stop talking. New game. Here we go. I cannot wait for this. It's of course by Wadget Eye Games. May you be snatched away from this place. You shall no more dare to deceive, persecute, and torment. As smoke is driven away, as wax melts before the fire, so shall you be driven away, unclean spirit. Uh, where am I? What's going on? Help! <laughs> where am I? Silence! Now, answer true. Are you demon, man, or woman? I mean... Okay, we can either be a man, a woman, or a demon. I'm, I'm kind of tempted to be a demon, honestly, to see what that's all about. No, you are not. Oh, no, we're not. Well. <laughs> Answer me true. Are you a man, woman, or demon? Okay, so uh, what the hell are you talking about? Damn it. No, just answer. Do as he says, unless you want a broken wrist. <laughs> all right, okay. So should we be a man or a woman? Let's go for woman. Demon, Ooh. your power over her mind is waning. Release her now! Release her before I am forced to destroy you! Remember! You are human! Remember! Whoa. Tell us, before the demon regains control, your name. Tell us your name! Okay, our name is... Turian. Did you hear that, evil spirit? She knows herself. She is yours no longer. Now your past. Tell me something about your past. Your profession. Quick. Okay, profession. So this is like a character customization thing, which I wasn't expecting. I'm not telling you anything. I'm an actor. Our show opens next week. I'm a police officer. Let me go before I arrest you both. I'm a bartender. Let's all sit down and talk about this. Um, let's be a bartender. That seems like a relatively normal thing, right? Yes. She's beginning to remember. Night after night, you pour drinks and help people forget their troubles. You give them the strength to push forward, to prevail. Now it's your turn. Take your own advice. Fight it! Remember who you are! Get remember! Zapped. Wow, okay. The Bronx, Sammy's bar, one year ago. That was quite the opening. Okay. Oh, I like that it um it gives a little description there. Look, this tree often does double duty as Sammy's second bathroom. It's interesting. So it actually we don't actually have to click to look at it, it actually just tells us. That's a, a nice little mechanic actually. Parked in a tow zone, the world loves an optimist. Teenagers like to throw beer bottles off this bridge. You try and stay clear. I love, love, love the look of this so far. It is really quite stunning. Um, the sign was just recently installed. It's the only new thing about this place. Uh, it looks like the sanitation department is late picking up the trash again. So yeah, if you're new to the channel, um, I like to really explore. I, I don't rush through games. I take my time. I look at everything. I exhaust dialogue options where I can, things like that. So uh, this isn't going to be a speed run or anything like that. It's going to be a real immerse ourselves in the experience playthrough. Uh, this diner is a great place to get food after Sammy's closes. Maybe you'll head over after work. Yeah, that sounds quite cool. Can we go in? Hey, we can. wait. Who's this? Uh Long time no see. Uh, Logan, what are you doing here? I'm surprised to see you here. I thought you were on the wagon. Logan, what are you doing here? I shouldn't be here. I know, but I need your help. It's my brother. You remember, Jenna? He's in there. He's bad. Badder than me on my worst day. Your boss called me to take him home, but... Uh, you don't want to go in? I understand I'll get him out. Uh, can't you do this yourself? <laughs> he obviously doesn't want to go in. There's some sort of history here, so let's do Thanks. it. No, that's fine. We're a First nice person. Thing I tell you is not to enter gin joint if you can avoid it. I've gone four years. I exactly. Can't them. Not even for him. Yeah. So he's obviously a recovering alcoholic and things. We don't want him to go into the bar. It's kind of selfish. No. I mean, we. 
If he feels like he doesn't want to go in there because it would be a temptation for him, then let's do Thank it. Thank you. You have no idea. Just talk to him, okay? He practically lives in this place. You know him better than I do. And don't tell your boss I'm out here. I don't think she likes me too much these days. Okay, fine. Well, we can go. Can we say more? Logan looks good these days. Sobriety seems to suit Seriously. Thanks for this. I'll owe you one. Now, the music is absolutely incredible so far on this. I'm really, really enjoying it. And it's by, um, it's by Thomas Regan. I believe that's how you pronounce it. I'm sorry, Thomas, if, if you are by any chance watching this and I've mispronounced that, I'm really, really sorry. Um, he is an incredible composer and musician. I actually had a few beers with him at Adventure X this past weekend, and he is a lovely down-to-earth bloke really really funny so um thank you for the beer as well thomas if you are watching um let's head in but yeah the, the music is just so good isn't it oh, thank god you're here uh reporting for duty boss you can relax i'm here are you okay do i look okay not really i swear to things i gotta deal with <sighs> fuck this after tonight i'm done i quit uh, I spoke to Logan outside. Maybe we don't say that. Let's ask if Jonah's here. No, let's ask about her first. It's Jonah. You know Jonah, right? He's here. He's lost it. In my bar. And I can't get him out. I thought Logan was a mean drunk, but Jonah? He's worse. He came in here all twitchy and looking scared. He asked for a whiskey and I gave it to him. Oh. Then he started crying. Then he started screaming. Now he's locked himself in the damn bathroom. Okay, did you call the police? What did you do? I called up his brother Logan, that's what. Right, so that's how Logan like knew. His precious sobriety is more important than helping his brother. But maybe. Look, maybe you can get him out of there. He's always listened to you. Uh, I'm his bartender, I'm good at that. Why me? Just how much did he drink? Honestly, I'm surprised he's still standing. Look, get him out the door. You can scream at the rats in the park for all I care. I'll just wait here. Okay. Let's have a look around a bit first, shall we? We can go back out. Uh, there's a jukebox here for ambience. It hasn't worked in 10 years. <laughs> nice. These pictures came with the bar when Sammy bought it. She has no idea what they are. Still early in the evening. The crowds don't come in until later. So what's that? About 25 past 9? Sammy put a few stickers up here years ago. Somehow they multiplied. Not exactly a top shelf collection, but you're working on it. Uh, Sammy LaGuardia, your boss and friend. She's looking more frazzled than usual tonight. Yeah, it sounds like it's been a bit of an eventful evening so far. These stools are held together with duct tape and a prayer. <laughs> Covered with countless glass stains, nobody uses the coasters you've brought in. The vibe is fantastic so far, it really is. Um, there's a key here, so maybe we need the bathroom key. Oh, the key? Yeah, I guess that'll work. Yeah, well, uh, you seriously didn't think to use the key? <laughs> Don't look at me like that. You want the truth? I didn't use the key because Jonah's scaring the hell out of me. Yeah, fair enough. I was gonna give the key to Logan, but he's a no-show. Guess he'll have to do. I guess we will. Right, our inventory's up here. Very nice. Um, Sammy keeps the darts behind the bar. Maybe you'll play later. Huh, I wonder if there'll be like a little mini game or something. Anything there? No. All right, well, the bathroom. Go away, Sammy. Uh, it's not Sammy, it's me, Turian. Jonah, it's me, Logan sent me. Oh, it's you. I just, I just can't. No, no, shut up, just stop. I'm sorry, it's, it's not you. You've always been good to me. What? I know you tried. It just didn't work. Just leave me alone. Uh, who's he talking to? What didn't work? Them. They just won't leave. Shut up, shut up, shut up. I can't, I can't. Not till, not till, no. Uh, okay, open the door now? Come out, just talk to me. Damn it, no. Just go away, get out. What did I tell you? Uh, he's definitely acting weird. What the hell is wrong with him? Poor Jonah, we've got to help him. You want to cuddle him? Do it when you're not here. Take my advice and stay away from guys like that. I know it's not good for business, but some people just shouldn't drink. <laughs> Crap like that runs in the family. I should have barred Jonah along with his drunk ass brother. I think there might be more going on here. Something more supernatural than you realize. I said go away. Well, he's not opening the door, so 
let's uh let's open it ourselves oh my god I locked that door for a reason uh okay what the hell do you think you're doing put the gun down I, I don't think I can do that they keep talking to me with the begging and pleading and crying can't you hear them they are so loud uh you're hearing voices I don't hear anything you need help help who can help me with this I thought I had it bad with just her but now there are so many so so many I close my eyes they're there I try to sleep they're there I tried to drink they are still here it got so bad my boss fired me me just like they fired my brother it just keeps getting worse I can't make them go away uh okay <sighs> I don't know if there's like choices and consequences in this game at all. I'm a little bit worried. <laughs> Who are they? There are dozens of them. Hundreds. They're surrounding me, surrounding you. I can't stop them. All I can do is join them. Uh, okay. You don't have to die. Yes, I do. I have to join the army of the dead. No, you don't. The only way to do that is to die. No. Uh, you're paranoid. No, that seems a bit confrontational. Uh, Army of the Dead? Yeah. They started coming about a month ago. First goes came a little girl. She told me I was chosen. Then I started seeing more and more everywhere. They won't leave me alone. If I have to die to make it stop, then so be it. Ugh, I get the feeling he's going to do it. Enough of this crap. Just pull the trigger already. Wow. You can get help, Joan. There are treatment. Drugs. Uh, if you're going to pull the trigger, you've done it by now. <laughs> I really don't know what to do in this situation, honestly. Um, there are treatment drugs. I get the feeling he'll say no to this. But will he just do it if we say... If we do that? Let's let's do what? this. You think being locked up in Bellevue is better? Locked in Bellevue with these dead things? I've thought about it. Asking for help. I can't live like this, but... I don't want to die, man. I, I don't want to die. Good, don't Why die. Why is this happening? Uh, we'll get you help, I promise. You're under a lot of strain. Just hand over the gun. You think? I don't know if I can be helped. You can. Uh, it's worth a try, I guess. Nice. Here, just take it. Oh. You and Sammy, man. You've always been good to That me. was tense. And this book. You can take this too. Uh, book? Yeah. I thought it would help. It's about spirits and ghosts and stuff. It had techniques to make them go away. But I think it's just made it worse take it will you i just don't want to look at it okay interesting whoa oh my god what the hell let's go i owe sammy an apology what was that a gunshot to jonah oh my god what the hell what is going on Your chosen vessel remembers. You are no longer welcome, wicked spirit. Jeez. The hands you control will no longer do your bidding. In the name of myself, my witness, and the soul whom you hold captive, I cast you out! Oh damn, it's working. I think. <laughs> gotcha. Eli! Whoa. Okay. She looks ordinary but had a grip like a steel vice. She's hovering over the, the man like a mother hen. Judging by the view, you're somewhere in Brooklyn, quite far away from your bar in the Bronx. Okay. Uh, we don't have any items. Stand back! Oh, God. Jeez, Mandy, put that sword away. The spirit is gone. That lady's harmless. Oh, okay. Uh, it's me, totally harmless. Now, who are you people? Could you put that sword down and tell me what just happened? <laughs> harmless, I'll show you. Harmless, tell me what's going on. See, she doesn't even remember how she got here. Looks like her memory got scrambled during the exorcism. Scrambled? What? It happens. I apologize for the threat. It has been a long night. Please, come with us and we will explain everything. Uh, how about you tell me right here? Because I am cold, soaking wet, and I have been outdoors all night. However, if you want to stay up here, you are welcome to. 
Look, she's a... We've had a rough night. Go easy on us, okay? Just come on downstairs. When you're ready, we'll explain everything. We're the good guys. Honest. God damn, that was, uh... <laughs> Dramatic. Wow. Um, I'm already hooked on this. I can't wait to play more of it. Uh, so, we'll leave it there for this one, but I will be back, well, next week in this Friday slot to play the second episode and the rest of this game, of course. Um, if you do want to get access to it early before everyone else, you can check out my Patreon at patreon.com slash Tyrion Shepherd. I've also got a Patreon exclusive series uh, I'm doing of the, the Blackwell games on there as well, which will be coming to the channel at some point in the future, uh, just not yet. <laughs> But that is going to do it for this one. So as always, guys, thank you very much for watching. A big thank you to my patrons, Arcades Games, Wayne, Nate, Termini Nerdy, Paul from the Phantom Fellows, Lyle, Barry Aldridge, Hobo, and Numinous for all the support on the channel. I really do appreciate it. And I'll see you next time.